So first of all, what I've done is I've gathered a few tools, um, a screwdriver, just to make sure um, I can get into the case, a pair of wire snips, just in case I need anything. Um, it's a little bit dirty, so I've got some antibacterial wipes as well. And there's probably going to be a few things that I want to change. You know me, I like things nice and silent, so it's going to get a silent fan put in there if it hasn't already got one. Let's face it, I'm probably going to change it anyway for the simple fact that it's probably not nice. Um, and let's see what we've got. So this actually cost me 30 quid, and I think for this particular PC case, and, and the fact that it's rack mounted, it's really good, because these go for about £99 in the UK. Um, so £30 really good. It's got this wonderful door on the front. It's a little bit squeaky, but we can fix that. Um, and it's got this, so I'll, I'll take these top letters off and leave it as server at the bottom. Let's give it a quick wipe down on the front so it looks a little bit more respectable. It's got a bit of sticky residue. You'll notice it's got two USBs on the front as well. And um, it's got a key, which is good. It's got a 3.5 inch drive bay for those very old floppy disk drives. Not that I'm going to put one in here. So there's definitely no DVD in this, um, which is no problem because I've already got one. Maybe get a Blu-ray drive as well, just to make it look pretty. 